Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will teach you how to create this college animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and right now I will show you how to create college animation for beginner After Effects users. So first of all, let's create new background solid layer and add name background, click OK and move to behind office layer and go to FX presets, search effect fill, select fill, let's use for background layer and go to color cube, change to like this color, click OK. So select this home layer, go to solo and let's use black and white effect. And select this black white effect let's use for home layer okay and select office layer go to solo and let's use black and white effect for office layer okay so in this time select this background and lock layer select other layers let's click this icon for 3d layer okay and create new camera tool Click OK, don't change any settings, click OK and select this camera, let's right mouse, go to camera and create orbit node for control all this scene. And I want to move the anchor point center, let's hold control and double click this icon for move the anchor point center. Clicization tool and right now I can make movements with this null object. OK, and for work fast, change quality quarter. So, first of all, let's select these office and cloud layers. And let's zoom out. And select this red arrow. Move to X axis to right. OK, so, and select this null object. Let's press P. And move to right and make new pass in keyframe go to here and move to center this home layer and go to enable title action save okay let's move to center like this and select keyframes make easy go to graph editor select this graph let's make smooth graph like this Okay, not bad. So back to two frames and let's go to text, color white and let's click here, write home. Clicization tool and move to here and select this home layer, press S and change scale, move to down a little bit. Okay, pretty good and select home text layer change font size and put to center okay so select this home text layer go to window open animation composite 3 open starter preset and text anime character select this overshot click in and close window so select this mark move to right for slow animation and move to right click this checkbox for 3 d layer Let's see. Okay, move to left a little bit. Okay, so in this time, select this null object. Let's click here for create new keyframe and go to some seconds. Let's move to back and move to left. Okay, so select this office layer. Let's move to left here. And let's press S, change scale. Okay, and move to up. Let's hold control, press R, and select here one line. Let's see, okay. And select this office layer. Let's move to a little bit. Okay, so 
select these layer clothes and move to here and move to front z axis and hide for now okay so let's animation okay not bad select this office let's move right here and select this text layer Control D move to right and let's double click right office Clusation tool so we can select this office layer let's move to down a little bit and select office text layer also move to down okay so in this time go to pen tool and let's hold shift make one line okay clearization tool go to click fill select none for close inside color and go to stroke width okay let's change this 10 and select this shape layer one go to add and trim path and let's open trim path one here let's move right this shape layer change end zero make end keyframe, frame and go to here let's move right and select keyframes, frames make easies let's select this work area and go to solo okay let's close the path and open shape one stroke one and change bed cup to run cup for smooth start and end lines and click this plus icon for create dashes and change dashes okay and go to back let's create new offset keyframe go to here and change offset minus 2000 Okay, select the shape layer 1, press U, select these offset keyframes, move to right. Okay, this is very fast, select last keyframe, move to right. Okay, let's try move to left first keyframe. Nice. So, let's unsolo and let's animation. Okay, let's move to left. Nice. Select the shape layer one. Move right. Okay. Uh, let's see timing. Select this first offset keyframe. Move to left. Okay. So in this time. Let's create new keyframe for camera orbit null and go to some keyframes and let's zoom to office layer and, and let's move right and move to down. Let's zoom in a little bit like this. Okay move to center and let's see nice and in this time select the shape layer 1 press T make opacity keyframe and go to here change 0 and right now select these four cloud layers enable and select all clothes layers move to center and select this cloud let's move the back z axis and this cloud chain scale move to down and this cloud chain scale move to here and this cloud move to back and chain scale and let's move to down like this okay so select these cloud layers press t in zooming time change opacity zero create new opacity keyframes and go to here 
change 100%. Nice. So let's see timing. Okay, so in this time, we can select these camera keyframes. Let's move to left and clothes. Move to left. Also, this cloth, move to left. And shape layers, move to left. Okay, not bad. And let's go to shape layer. Select this rectangle tool. And let's create background for text layer. Click station tool and change stroke with zero. Open fill, select yellow color, click OK. And let's click for 3D layer. Let's move to here. Move to up. Move to behind to text layer. And select shape layer. Let's select and move to behind of text layer. And change scale like this. Let's see. Okay, so right now let's select the shape layer 2, move to right. And press T, change opacity 0, make opacity keyframe. Go to here and change 100%. And right now, select Office Text Layer. Let's go to Edit and Split Layer or Control Shift D. And go to Color Change to Black. Select this work area and Preview. Okay, nice. And select the Shape Layer 2. Go to here, hold shape, press P, make new person keyframe, and go to here, move to the left. Okay, make keyframes easy. And move to the left a little bit. Okay, I like it. And select these camera keyframes, go to graph editor, and select last graph, move to left for more smooth animation, and select last keyframe, move to right. Okay, not bad. And let's select these keyframes, move to left. And select these clothes. Move to right. And for random clothes animation, let's change keyframes like this. Okay, so finally, let's select these camera keyframes. Go to Graph Editor and select this graph. Let's try and move to right for more smooth animation. Nice. And select last keyframe, move to right. Okay, that's good. Okay, so guys, finally let's select all these layers and close keyframe settings. And let's unlock this background. Select background, Ctrl D for duplicate and change layer name grid and go to FX presses search effect grid select this grid let's use for grid layer and let's change size from width slider change slider like this and change opacity okay let's see nice let's see difference Okay, and 
Select these layer clothes and press U for CA keyframes. Okay, let's press U again, close keyframes. And let's press P. Make new passing keyframe and go to 9 seconds. Press N and select this cloud layer. Let's move to right. And select this cloud layer, move to left. And this cloud layer, move to right. And this, move to left. So let's select this work area and preview animation. Okay, pretty good. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.